Got a game. Some batteries on charge. Low plug battery on charge. I'm going to get out my little willy. Yeah, so um, I'm hoping these will hold a charge. I haven't charged this, this bloke up for a while either. It's got to be. Oh. <clears throat> it's 2007. So, so that's fairly old. But I've not had the uh, I've not had the wheelies out for a bit. I thought while I'm home I might fire him up. I think that, I'm not sure if this is charged up. Oh. Oh yeah. We've got charging him. Might just pop him on the charger. He's uses a USB style there. Little little battery in there, it's a great thing. And uh, I'll get my little willies up and we'll have a bit of a look at it. Yeah, so here he is. My little willy. 1941 willies. Uh, tenth scale radio control car. It has a um, a 0.12 uh, Techwell racing engine and racing pipe. Um, yeah, a vintage style wheels. And. Uh, yeah, I've had it for over ten years, and I haven't had it haven't had it running, or haven't had it going for um, well over a year, I expect. But um, see what happens when it sits around. That's it. They're all rusty. They were nice and shiny, but they're all rusty now. Anyway, let's get the um, let's get the shell off him and and have a look oh, under there. Yeah, that's what it looks like under there. That's the Techwell race engine, a racing pipe. I think that air cleaner is just about, yeah, she's over. So I won't be able to run it with that on it. Guaranteed. I used to have extra air cleaners, but they might be gone too. I'll go and see if I can no. find another one. <laughs> I'll, have to go and, I'll have to go and buy another one of them. I think she's just, that one's pooched, most definitely. I used to have about three or four of them, but I, uh, yep. That's what happens when they sit around, I suppose. So, um, anyway. That's it. That's the one. Um, it's a pull start. It hasn't been, it hasn't been turned over for, a, as I say, it hasn't been run for a year. But, uh, I hope it still turns over. Uh-huh. Good. It's always a good idea when you put them away, you uh, put them away with uh, after run oil. It's like a silicon based oil that you put in the, uh, pull the glow plug out, put some down the, the carburetor, pull it over a couple of times and it gets rid of the, uh, the racing fuel and the methanol and uh, stops oxidisation going on. Um, but yeah, it's a little all wheel drive thing. Four-wheel drive, two-speed gearbox, as you can see. Oh, yes, can you see me? Two-speed gearbox, right here. And um, racing carburetor. That engine turns at 35,000 RPM. I'll see if I can get the the gaff on it. Uh, it seems know. all that stuff's gone MIA too. So, but never mind. I mean, all this stuff used to be nice and shiny, chrome and or whatever coating it was, it was shiny at the time. But uh, after 10 years, uh, not much good. Oh, jeez, it might have got some, still got a bit of battery in it. Not enough battery though. So, um, that's what I, uh, that's what we're tuning with. Um, it's all tuned with 
that's the temperature right now everything's like it filming it is what it is it's 27 degrees well the air temperature is 27 degrees anyways that's 27 everything's 27 degrees so um, Yeah, if you, have a, if you have a little look, you can see that the outside of the tyre is fairly wide. Mind you, the inside is just like on a radio control where they're small, so they're specially designed wheel and tyre. And, um, hmm. So what I'm going to do, I might just, um, I might just fire him up even though he's got no batteries in him I'll pour some fuel into it and um, I'll pour some fuel into it and I uh, might let it dust idle over for a little bit uh, just to warm itself up and make sure everything's okay well, I hope the fuel's oh. alright that's what I use and this one is 16% uh, uh, and uh, smells nice. Um, used to mess about with this quite a bit. And it's probably had about, well, that's a litre bottle. Um, and it's probably had eight. 10 bottles go through it so it's not like I didn't used to use it that's all we really need just a little and that's kind of three quarters of a tank that and uh, three quarters of a tank if you're going at it uh, that'll last probably about five minutes if you're just puttering around it'll last 25 minutes so it does go through a bit So this fella's been on, uh, so this, this, this fella's charged up and up. And as I say, it has been a while. I even forgot to prime it up, how about that? Oh, she's it's flooded. That's a flooded a lot.
let that warm up for a while. Takes a little bit. And that's how I stop him. Now, these are not rechargeables. The other ones are just not, I think they're just over the, over the, I've had them for over 10 years, those ones. So, that's that. Now this radio system has a, a fail safe in the, uh, in the receiver. Um, if you don't know what a fail safe is, well, it, it eliminates a getaway. In other words, if this, if the radio loses signal um, without the fail safe, the vehicle will go to more than likely wide open throttle and keep going in the in the act in in the direction that you last set it. So straight ahead, more than likely. I always put an elastic of some sort around the battery box that stops the batteries from falling out. That's a better chance of um, not having an issue. Um, if I turn that on, you can see there, see it's blinking here. Can you see that? Can you, is it picking that up? Yep. If I turn the radio on, we stop the blinking. We've got throttle, we've got brake, we've got, we've got turn. So, Righto. Ready. Ready to play. Just tuck all this stuff back in. And, uh, we'll see how we go. We've got to come down this way more. Okay, back with you in a moment. So the plan was to see if I could get something on, yep, on the camera. I think I went in slow motion. That was the plan. We'll see what happens. Episode's a good one. Cheers.